Hi, hello and welcome back to our channel. So today, let's see how we can add blocks to website in Odoo 40. So Odoo blocks represent one of the Odoo's amazing features. So it makes use of Odoo's uh, seamless framework and offers stunning user interfaces that may be required by most companies to reveal their practical or technological interactions to news or other media. So you can easily share these posts on many other social medias like Facebook, Google Plus, Twitter. So this work is actually made better by Odoo Blog. So these blogs and articles can be managed on Odoo uh, backend from backend and can be built using Odoo CMS Editor. So from backend, uh, you can see here this our website module. So here we can see a separate uh, menu. Here we can view the blog post. So you can see the title of the blog, or the who created uh, the blog, then the um, blog post, then the blog under which the blog post is created, then the website in which uh, it is published. Uh, so you can see these blogs are published on all websites and you can see number of views of each blog post, last contributor and last updated date and time. So you can create a new blog post uh, by clicking create button and here we can select the blog. So we have travel uh, astronomy and you can set a title, subtitle, set tags. Then here we have some publishing option and you can create blog post from backend. And we can see the views of blogs. So here we have uh, option to configure blogs, tags and tag categories. So from here you can see already two blogs are created, astronomy, travel. And you can create new blog like you can create a blog food and add subtitle and restrict to website. Okay, now let's go back to dashboard and go to our website and see how we can create a blog from our website. So here we can find a button, an option that is new. So when you click on new. Here you can find an option to create new page or blog post for event, product, forum, job offer or course. So just click on blog post and here we have to select the blog. Uh, so I want to create a blog post in food blog and you can click continue. So when you click continue you can see the page uh, where we can set the blog post title. So if I creating north Indian food item that is blog post and here you can find option that is styling options so uh, here we can write uh, here we can add description details and for each object we can add styling you can find styling options so from here you can drag title images to your page then we can also find other customization uh, options, theme options, button, input, settings. Okay, so after adding these things to your blog post, you can save the page. And after saving, you have to publish the blog. Then only users visiting the page can view the blog post. So I'm going to publish this. You can see you have published your blog post. And here you can find a separate menu to view all the blogs and blog post. So you can see the latest blog post, North Indian. And we can view all the blog post coming under. Uh, so you can see all. So we can view all the blog posts. Then we can view blog post under bl blog travel, astronomy, food. So you can see here company name then you can see with name of the blog post short description tags publishing date and from here we can search for a blog so you can see the related result four articles okay and you can select a blog from here and if you wish to edit this page, this blog, you can just click on edit. 
and add uh, changes to your blog post. So that's how we add uh, blogs to website in Odo 14. And if you want to know more about customizations, uh, that is how to create page and edit layout in Odo 14, we have done a separate video. So please check that. If you are interested in knowing more about this or looking for any Odo implementation or customization in your business, drop your request to odo at cyprosis.com.